The idea of luck is by all accounts a catch-all for things we can't clarify, like enduring lethal encounters or stumbling upon world-modifying creations. Sometimes we witness events that are absolutely unlikely and hardly accidental. It seems that nobody designed these events, so they can only happen one certain way despite the fact that we don't have the foggiest idea why. Certain individuals simply appear to have more luck than others. Welcome to 5 Entertainment. In today's video, we will be counting down the list of six extremely lucky moments where people survived the worst. Number one is going to change your perspective of luck. Before we start the video, do not forget to subscribe and like the video. Number six, hard time with rocks. It was another fine weekend morning for the famous mountain climber and engineer Aaron Ralston. He had not told anyone about his hiking trip Canyonlands National Park in Utah. He cycled about 15 miles to reach the Blue John Canyon an 11 mile long gorge that is some places is just three feet wide. He locked his bike and walked towards the canyon opening. At around 2.45 p.m. as he descended into the canyon, a giant rock above him slipped. Ralston fell and his right hand became lodged between the canyon wall and the 800 pound boulder. Ralston hadn't told anyone about his climbing plans and he didn't have any way to signal for help. He inventoried his provisions, two burritos, some candy bar crumbs, and a bottle of water. He futilely tried chipping away at the boulder, using the torque from his trapped arm. He managed to break his ulna and his radius and finally the complete arm. He left his arteries for last, knowing that after he severed them, he wouldn't have much time. The entire process took an hour, during which Ralston lost 25% of blood and he managed to free himself from the rock and descend down. Finally, he was rescued by another family and medical reached for help. Now he has become a famous hero and his life story was filmed in the movie 127 Hours. Number 5. Walk Back from Heaven Bill Morgan has always been on news channels for how lucky he is. He has won several huge lotteries, but in 1998, truck driver Bill encountered a heavy accident after which he was rushed to the hospital. His heartbeat had stopped and his family and the doctors had lost hope. While his family was panicking and his supposed end was near, luck had other plans for him. Suddenly, after 14 minutes, what the doctor saw was shocking. The electrogastrogram started showing those lines of life again, and Bill started breathing once again, and his heart started beating too. He was kept for bed rest in the hospital, and slowly and gradually, he showed signs of recovery from the coma. The family and doctors had hope again, and fortunately, after 12 days, he fully came out of the coma. He was speaking coherently and laughed at the sight of his family. Surviving 14 minutes of no heartbeat just sounds crazy, doesn't it? He literally did what we call walk back from heaven. Number 4. The Free Fall At the age of 34, a travel freak and incredibly lucky man, Frayne Salek, simply survived the impossible. He was traveling in a plane going for vacation when suddenly the door of the plane, which was supposedly weak, burst open due to the high pressure. Frayne was pulled outside the plane. He was in the air and was rushing down to the ground at a speed at which nothing other than a thousand pieces of him would have been found on the ground. But wait. Luck had other plans for him, and hence, luckily, he landed on a truck filled with soft straw. Hey, and fortunately, only had minor injuries. He was taken to the hospital immediately by the farm driver, and the doctors did their job, and after just a month, Frank Selleck was totally fine again. Well, this wasn't the only lucky moment in his life. He, in particular, is also very famous because he has survived a train that fell from the track where 17 people died, but he survived, and also an incident in which his bus sank into the river, but yet he survived. Perils did not end here. His two cars had exploded due to fire in the fuel tank, but still he lived and only had minor injuries. He is a lucky man indeed. Number 3. The Treacherous Parachute Well, this is the story of an incredibly lucky woman who had, in 1999, already completed a whopping 35 parachute jumps and was going to do her 36th. The door opened and without any fear, Joanne Murray of North Carolina jumped out into the air at a heart freezing nerve-wracking height of 14,400 feet. But this time, it was going to be a lot different. Suddenly, she realized that her parachute wasn't opening up. It had failed, but she knew what to do. She opened the small emergency parachute, but unfortunately, the threads of the parachute got entangled, and she started going around and around and around, and hit the ground at a destructive speed of 80 miles per hour. Luckily, she fell on a mud house of ants. It was impossible for her to survive before the ambulance came, but her heart still kept beating. Because she was bit by a thousand ants with ant poison and it contains solenopsin, which in such large amounts kept her heart beating. She was saved by an ant venom, or else she would have never made it. 
This shocking experience with death also did not stop her and she completed her 37th parachute jump too. Hats off to her courage. She deserved all the luck she got. Number 2. Tornado Ride While young Matt Suter was watching TV at his grandma's house, he had no idea what was just about to happen. Suddenly, the roof of the house got blown away and Matt was taken 130 feet up in the sky by the tornado. The roof got totally broken into pieces and also his car was torn into pieces by the tornado. The tornado kept on devouring for almost three to four hours and when help came, he was missing. After searching in the nearby fields, he was found lying unconscious in the fields nearby. He had hopefully got no severe injuries and had just fainted. He was treated by medics and in just a matter of a few hours, he came into his senses. His minor wounds were dressed and treated and in a matter of just a week, he was totally fine playing for his school team. Although the roof, the car, and everything else were in pieces as the tornado was so huge and intense, he had made it out of the monstrous moment. It is still so hard to believe. It's a story of pure good luck. The last but not least is a mind-boggling example of a girl surviving the impossible. Number 1. The Curse of the Snow Queen This is the story of Jean, a girl from Minnesota who was driving at night in the chilly winter when suddenly her car crashed into a snow ditch. When after trying for long, it didn't come out. Jean decided to walk to her friend's home, which was nearby. The cold was extreme and the temperature had fallen as low as negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit, but she was not adequately dressed for that cold. She was shivering madly and when she had almost made it to the yard of her friend's house, she fell on the snow. She had no energy to stand up, so she started crawling, but on the way, she completely froze into a solid. Later, after some time when her friend came out, she was shocked to see an ice sculpture which looked exactly like Jean, but he noticed bubbles coming from her nose. That was when he realized what had happened and Jean was rushed to the hospital. Even the injection needles wouldn't break on her hard skin, so she was covered with heat pads and miraculously she kept breathing and woke up when she became warm and was out of critical condition. She is still called the fairy tale character Elsa by people. Well, this is the end of our list for today. Before you leave, let us know in the comments. Who do you think was the most luckiest, and if you had any lucky moments in your life as well? We will be back with more amazing content soon, so do hit the notification bell icon.